Yo, what's up guys? It's Kisuke Place here with a small tutorial of GTA San Andreas. I uh, actually wanted to do it this to a friend of mine, but I was like, hey, you s as I'm already going to explain it, let's just do a, a tutorial. Maybe it could help another guy. There, there are quite a lot of tutorials of this, but I don't know. I haven't seen any of them. I just want to try to give you a simple yet detailed uh, tutorial. So. Uh, starting, you will have to download uh, GGMM, so the GTA Garage Mod Manager. I'll have a link in the description where you can download it, and then when you'll open it, you'll have these three files. So mostly you'll just need the X and the DLL, but I like to put the free. So just throw them in your GTA San Andreas main folder, and boom, then you have it there. So you can close this, open this. So now you just go and open GGMM. You'll get something like this. So now you have here the whole list of the, of the cars. So now we're going to in install a few cars. So we'll have an Audi A3 to install, a, uh, the Ferrari, La Ferrari, and an R18 e-tron Audi. So we're going to start with the Audi, which is the club. So you as you can see here, the club is stock. So what you should do before installing anything, you right click it and do create backup. That can help you if you install a mod that you don't like or so. You just do create backup. Then you see it creates here on the car backups folder and has a file in it. That's the backup of it. So now you can just do restore from backup, which is a, a GG, GGM package. So yeah, just installs it. So now what you can do is you do manual mod installer. You search for the DFF model. Uh, at the moment, my desktop. So there's that. There it is. Club FF. And club txd. There you go. So it, some cars also have collision files and so on. And then also this special lines handling line here. You would put like club and the line it has in the the handling uh, the the readme as, as I mean colors line and so on. But yeah. So once you've done, you've selected two. You just go install. Wait for it to finish. And done. And bam. There you go. So now there's actually look, some mods may not look how they look in game because of different uh, materials and so on, but don't worry. So now what you also have, you can animate or view model details and you can have some fun with it. I'll just try to make this bigger for you. All right. So now let's have some fun. You can change color as you can see. Uh, light textures to see if it has any lights. Uh, you can animate the wheels, the car wheels, show the dummies, reflection maps. Here's the reflection. Wow. <laughs> and uh, so yeah, now here special you can open the various stuff. You can just open all, and you can see everything inside. There you go. Look at that. Oh, nice speakers. <laughs> So yeah, got that and close. You can also turn the wheels. Yeah, this is what I always used. And your chi to check the old car. So yeah, but now for example, if you didn't like this car and you would like it back and forgot to take out DFF and TXD of the of the normal club, you, that's why you should have done that backup. You just go here, restore from backup, as this install mod. And just wait for a second, and kaboom! There it goes, it replaces everything. It replaced every single data of it handling, file, colors, vehicle ID, everything. So now to install the car, you don't always have to go to the car. You can just, for example, stay here. Let's, for example, now install the R18, so which is the hot ring. So the hot ring. Got the hot ring again. Install. Oh, and I forgot to to make the backup. But yeah, don't worry. If I forgot to make a backup. I'll have uh, another download link in the this uh, in the description that of a folder I did quite a long time ago on my GTA San Andreas times. There's the backup of pretty much every file of GTA of the whole data of the whole I don't know everything you can not. There's just not the the big files, the EM, IMG files, 
and you have also the whole folder of the car backups of every car so yeah don't worry I can show you later so what you can also just search here you go hot ring and there you go oh look at that look at that beauty my texture's on doesn't have any but looks of it great huh so special open all wow only doors huh great <laughs> but yeah you can really just go and fully look at it yeah close all there you go so here now, but now if you were to create backup of like this, it would make the backup of this car. So you would, whenever you would restore from the backup, it would reinstall you that car. So yeah. So now let's go for example at the Turismo now. We have this create backup manual mod installer. And we go for the Turismo, which is a LaFerrari install, place a model. Ba -ba -bum, replacing textures, ba -ba -bum, and done. And there we go. And yeah, that happens if you don't have the the handling files. But well, yeah, as you can see, open all, and there you go. Looking pretty solid. So now, I saw if you don't if you didn't like it, restore for backup, install mod, and just there. There you go. So that's simple. So that's how you pretty much install a car mod with this. It's pretty much a 10 second thing to do. It's just pretty pretty simple. So now I'm going to show you the... So after you install you can just close and go ahead and play. Now I'm going to show you the backup. Let me just find it here. GTI tools and... Here's my backup. There it goes. So you can see right here. Here it goes. It has data. Here's the GGMM thing. Just take card backups and just throw it in your in your folder uh, just, just same, same P. so for example you just remove this one and you just throw this onto your you know, GTA so now if you open GGA, GGMM for example now Buffalo there you have it uh, let me find a card which I have um, no. I don't know about Buffalo, no. Oh, well, here's a car of a friend of mine. So you just do restore from backup. And. Just am. You should normally have it. And there it is. There it goes. So for every car, even of the of the utilities, even of those I did, as you can see. So if, if you fuck things up, literally, don't worry. I, I took care. So yeah, you have your, have your car backups, the data everything of the data and the models not much there's the TXDs and the FXPs and so on I couldn't put the EMGs because that would be quite big of course movies the readme and the text you got everything in that backup uh, where are and uh, yeah so yeah that's so yeah that's pretty much it if you still have any questions uh, just comment them uh, or message me mail me about it and I'll Hopefully, we'll be able to help you, you know, with more stuff. If there's anything modding related, game related or so, just ask me. Maybe I'll do a, a tutorial of that. And yeah. So, hey guys, this was Kissing Place. See you next time. So, goodbye.